Tag Battle, episode Under Night Ember. We last left off, Hyde ran into Ruby, yet again creating the greatest ship in anime history, and we ran into Chie and Yosuke, and we befriended them, and then we kicked their asses, as this game does. So uh, Ruby ran after them thinking they had weapons, and now we're here, wherever this is. But I'm starting to see how the gears are turning here. Mm, that's good, well, at least one of us are. We're not the only ones who were dragged here from another world. Seems like everybody's from somewhere else. But the only way back is this damn keystone. And everyone here is ready to fight for it. Oh, except Chie and Yosuke didn't give a damn. It's pretty complicated. If anything, you initiated the fight. I just gotta make sure I don't let my guard down. Speaking of which... Stop hiding! Oh, Blake. Hey there. I didn't think you'd notice me. You were pretty high up there. You must be really agile. Oh, yeah, I bet she is, dude. Why don't you talk to her and find out? Oh, I take it you're after the keystone? Oh, I'm so edgy. I, I, I'm so edgy and agile. Giving me the silent treatment, huh? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I love Well, Blake. unfortunately for you, I'm not ready to give this up. So, you got pulled into this world, too? And you want to go home? Am I right? Nah, I want to stay here. It's just so lovely. At the abandoned fucking temple. Yes. That's right. Then please, just listen to me. I don't think that following the rules to a T is our answer. <laughs> if only the people with the keystones get to go home, that means everyone else gets left behind. Well, an interesting perspective. Everybody else uh, who got who, who received the old great blessings of the moderator were told that uh, everybody of their world would go get to go home. That's too cruel. Interesting as only There has you. to be a way for everybody to get back to where they're from. Until I figure that out, until I understand everything, I need to be really careful with how I handle this thing. Does that make sense? You know, it doesn't make sense. The size of Blake's chest! My god, it's not that big in the show. Same thing goes for Ruby's, too. She's fucking 16. Like, both of them got way busty. I mean, I'm not complaining. I get what you're trying to say, but we need to get back to our world as soon as possible. Besides, <sighs> I'm... Not like your group. There's no way I can place my trust in someone I just met. Hmm. Not like us? That's right. So if you're telling me that you can't give me your keystone, then you're giving me no choice but to take it. Alright. <sighs> Damn it. Fine. Why does it always end up like this? Huh? Who's there? This is really not what I need right now. Ah, oh, goddamn the darkness. Ah, oh, Makoto! Boy, you found me! I was gonna snag the keystone while you were distracted! Oh, that was close. Hmm. Can't let my guard down at all in this world. No, you cannot. So you're here to take this thing too, huh? Yeah, pretty much. Pretty It'd much. Be better if I didn't have to beat you up first, but uh, that's not happening, huh? Nope. I was just explaining that to this girl when you. Hmm. Is something wrong? Those ears and that tail. <laughs> Are you a fawness? What an awesome interaction. Why did I ever think of Makoto and Blink? They're so both fawness. Well, technically, Makoto is demi human in the Blaze Blue one, uh, but. <laughs> oh a my god. Fawness? What's that? <laughs> there are no squirrel girls in Remnant. <sighs> Don't worry about it. Oh, that's awesome. I'm Makoto! Makoto Nanaya! And it looks like Blake's gun blade is stuck up her ass. Or if her ass was that close to the edge of her tail. Nah, I'm not. I'm, it's not a real. Even though I've never heard the word faunus before, I'm gonna guess that it's similar to what we call a demi human. Yeah. Which would make you a faunus, huh? <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Oh my god. You can tell? Well, yeah. I work in the NOL's intelligence division. A ribbon isn't enough to hide those ears from me. No, it's enough to fool everybody else in Ruby. But I imagine they put you through hell in your world, too. Yeah, I know how that feels. Aw, oh, that's so cool! Aw, right. uh, there's no need to look so sad. It's part of what makes us special. Man, you could you would be a real good inspiration for the for the white fang. Special? That's right. For example, 
I love nuts. Okay, now that's now that's just a stereotype. That's not that's not anything interesting about being an animal girl. That's just stereotypical. All right. Do you think Blake loves? Well, oh, oh fuck! Blake loves fish. Oh my god. It's like when you Stereotypes are real. <laughs> the sweetness of the parfait combines with the nuttiness of the chestnut. No, no, my legs, puppies. Amazing. Do you get it now? Yeah. Oh, that reminds me. I didn't catch your name. Parfait may be the most delicious thing on the whole damn planet. <laughs> it's Blake. Okay, Blake. What kind of food do you like? Are we really doing this? I, like I love it. I love exposition. Seafood, I guess. So, uh... Seafood? <laughs> he drives the fucking edge in here. Dude, Someone's got some elegant this taste. is your chance to slip away. Really? While they're kindling their friendship or whatnot. I just like fish. Um, I'm really glad you guys are bonding over your favorite foods and stuff, but are we gonna actually fight or something? Oh, uh, I love it. Hey, anime. <laughs> draw my sword and everything. Yeah, oh, you've per... Yo, dude, you've permanently drawn your sword for, like past three episodes now and why would you want to fight them when you know you have to protect your keystone none of this really adds up. oh right sorry got kind of carried away there <clears throat> now hand over the keystone <laughs> Actually, and now they form a team strong. yeah okay, great Blake can I ask you, you do a favor girl strong. to girl what is it can you help me take that dude's keystone sure with pleasure oh, what's in it for you you're both from two different worlds. One of you is going to have to take the keystone for yourself. I, 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 I oh, somehow I knew this would happen. Whatever. Wait, don't I need a tag partner too? Yeah, otherwise nothing can happen. <laughs> Looks like you're in a pinch. Gordo! Yeah! Here I am wandering around and then I stumble onto this fun little scene. Guess my luck ain't so bad after all. Amnesia. Didn't think you guys would be here too. Ex amnesia, actually, dude. He's his whole arcade mode is about him ditching amnesia and killing Hilda. So come on. How long on. has it been since that night? My boss really put you through hell, huh? Ex boss and everybody kicked her ass, you included. Come I on. I never wanted to see your goddamn face again. I'll lighten up, kid. It's not data goes by when I don't want to see Gordo's face. Here. Oh, I'll tell you where you can put your hand. In your you pocket, like you it's want, always been, because it's something. deformed and weird. It has claws. Perish the thought. Didn't mean to eavesdrop or anything, but it sounds a bit like you need a partner in order to fight these young ladies. Are you telling me you want to team up? Yeah. Did my six pack tell you otherwise? Doesn't exactly look like you got much choice, does it? Wow. What a development. Are these the gentle stirrings of a blossoming tag team I see? Oh my god. What? Hold on a second. <laughs> I'm not gonna tag with- Stop quibbling about bygones. About They're bygones. Bygones for a reason, aren't they? Come on! Be a man! Oh god, don't ever make that voice How again. How does this have anything to do with being a man? The be a man voice. Don't- Please don't say it like that. I wouldn't want to team up with him if I were a woman either. Mm, there are other people in the fan base community that would beg to differ. Actually, I'm pretty sure there's already stuff that like that that exists. Give it up, Gender kid. bender hide. Just let me take part. I'm in sure that's somewhere. Movie. If I look real hard. <laughs> of course, that's all you care about. <sighs> Fine, but I've got some words for you once we're done with this. Are you ready yet? I'm getting bored here. As am I, Blake. Right. Let's As take him I. down, Blake. Look at that. We're really upping the voltage on this <sighs> one. Okay. Now. Let, yeah, right. let it begin. Let's take him down, kid. Don't just copy what she said. <laughs> I, I, I wouldn't know what she said. I just personally, I think Gordo said it better. Because, you know, Gordo does everything better. Just like fighting this fight better. Let's go, Gordo. Alrighty. Licking my coto. Can't escape oh, from Blake's theme. Fate. I'm loving it. Fight. Intruder, this identify way. yourself. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. Not yet. Not bad. Not bad. Toro. Look at you. Ooh. How's that? No escape. Not yet. Bye, sweetheart. I'll make 
Here we go. Gotcha. <laughs> Shire Vortex. Alright, combo attack. Yeah! Loving it. Barely even got through from shadows. <laughs> Ugh. We need to rethink our strategy. Maybe a different Wait movie song will make it a bit different. <laughs> Have you tried playing on the Sheesh. one? Those girls were crazy. <laughs> I thought they were fun. Yeah, go after them, bud. You're seriously the last person I would have expected to see here. Next one being Carmine, who you'll probably see. I don't even know how it happened. I was just here. At first, I thought it was the power of the night at work, but that doesn't seem to be the case. So, I started wandering in search of a familiar face. And after I had after a run-in with a younger version you. of myself dressed in red, I, uh, found you. <laughs> hey, Seriously, Rolling is so much like Gordo. About this world so far? According to the voice overseeing all of this, some weird rock is supposed to be the key back to our world. If I protect it until the end, I get to go back. Are you sure it's not in that pocket right there? That's pretty much all I know. Pretty much the same as me, then. But... But... You got it. If she really wanted us to fight over the keystone, she'd just have us kill each other until there's only one of us left. But that's not what she does. Once a battle is over, she doesn't lock up the loser or anything. She lets everybody go. Just to gain battle it Sounds to me like she she's wants. got an ulterior motive. <laughs> I'll say. My gut says that once the truth comes out, there's gonna be a whole lot of it coming out at once. But before all that, We've got to figure out what other worlds are connected to this one. Two. And the reason everybody you met, else You is literally fighting. met... Oh, no, mind. You, 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 Gordo hasn't seen it for so long, guys, so... I'll go start sniffing around for that stuff. You go and gather more info on the Keystone. Are you sure we should split up? That's not what I expected to hear. <laughs> Did you forget that we were enemies back in our world or something? Besides, I don't get a lot of chances to fight people like these in broad daylight. Right. <laughs> I'm not a one-tag partner kind of guy either. Got a lot of people I want to join up with. Namely, mainly Rock. Somehow, that doesn't surprise me. What can I say? And later Karma, when I fight the Persona children. Anyway, don't get that stone taken away before you face off with me now. <laughs> sure, if you can last that long. Oh, gosh. Okie dokie. Damn it. Didn't expect that I'd run into anyone from Amnesia here. Next time we run into Lee Christ Aurier or something fun like that, right? Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button to leave a comment on the else you can play in the future. I will see you guys next time. Later!